Hello my name is Dennis, and I'll be cooking deviled eggs four ways. I'll be following Tasty's latest and greatest cookbook, in an effort to cook the book, where I record my attempts to make every single recipe in the cookbook. The first two recipes are classic deviled eggs and guacamole deviled eggs. The classic deviled eggs I made off camera, because I didn't have this idea until recently. I topped them with the seasonings I had left over from the tornado potatoes I made, which turned out awful. Next was the guacamole deviled eggs, which I tried filming, and then my phone died halfway through a recording, so I scrapped it. They were fucking delicious though. My favorite one to make by far. Okay now we are doing loaded deviled eggs. The audio must have cut out for this clip but that's okay, because I wasn't saying anything extremely interesting anyway, because I knew I would have to edit a lot of the audio, while my family was being loud as fuck. Step 1 is to place the eggs in a pot and fill with cold water until the eggs are just covered. I put more than a dozen eggs in, because my mom wanted extra boiled eggs, to make salad with later. While they are boiling, I made the egg filling. You'll need a quarter cup of finely chopped fresh chives, but I definitely did not have enough. Made it work anyway. If you are good at cooking I hope you're looking away, because my knife skills are non-existent. But they successfully got chopped. Next we'll need 3 strips of bacon finely chopped. Had to make the bacon beforehand. Yes, still bad at chopping. Here's what we've got so far. Now we need half a cup of sour cream. I hate sour cream. Probably one of my least favorite toppings for anything in the world. It's just so. Sour. Why would anyone like this nasty shit? The texture is wet and fatty and gross. <coughs> half a cup of shredded cheddar. Also gross. Here's before mixing. And after, now that the eggs have boiled, I need to place them in ice water for 3 minutes. They're still hot please, don't tease me for wearing an oven glove oh, no, to move them. Cracking. I'm awful at peeling eggs, and it took me forever, so I sped it up 3000%, so you wouldn't have to watch. These poor eggs have gone through it, pray for them. Cut the eggs in half, and transfer the egg yolks to the mix bowl. I should get a GoPro. What? Why'd you yell? But I should get a GoPro to like, record a first-person view of me cooking. Wouldn't that be so cool? Mm -hmm. This one? Yeah, but my... But, like, that, I can't strap that to my head. This also took forever, so I sped it up. Alright. All the eggs have been cut. That would mix enough. I know it's mixed enough. Okay. Got a spoon the mix onto the egg whites. Yeah, this is absolutely awful. Let's top these suckers. Okay, they're done. Ooh, let's go. Uh -huh. I hate it. Well, you don't know what to do now. Thank you, Dad. I rate it one out of five stars. Maybe zero out of five stars. What? A little less, little less sour cream. Well, I did half a cup.
cup because that's what mm -hmm. I asked for. And then I added a little bit more because it looked too yolky. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't worry, there's always next time. You almost had it. Lastly, Cajun deviled eggs. Somehow my head ass lost the footage of me preparing the mix, but I'll just tell you about it while I peel all these eggs again. You need half a cup of mayo, 1 tablespoon of Dijon mustard, 1 tablespoon of Cajun seasoning, half a stalk of celery, finely chopped. Don't worry, I did a better job chopping this time. Half a bell pepper, finely chopped. They didn't have any green bell peppers, so I had to settle with my second favorite, the red bell pepper. And finally, 1 teaspoon of hot sauce, but I ended up putting in more hot sauce, to be bold and daring. Dang my hands do, be looking kinda sexy though. Okay, all of the eggs are done. Here's the demolished eggs. Don't ever let Dennis peel eggs. Meow. Here we go. Just one more step and I'll be done. I have to transfer the eggs. I have to cut them all in half. Transfer the egg yolks to a, this bowl. And then mix. Mix all the remaining ingredients with the yolks and transfer to a piping bag. I never use a piping bag, I just use a spoon. Okay, bet. Watch me. Watch me. My way or the highway. My way. My way or the highway. Don't worry, I won't make you sit here and watch me cut eggs in half. Transfer egg yolks, mix and place it into the egg whites. That's just boring. Yay! Yeah, I got them done way earlier than I thought. Like, my goal was to be done by 3, and I finished these in an hour and 24 minutes. <laughs> A miracle, don't eat them yet. I want to try first. Go This one is mine. It's so good. There's two right here. There's two. How are you gonna pick it up? Use a fork. Mmm. That's good. It's spicy. Oh, that's you. You're already able to feel the spicy stuff. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> it's a lot of oil. I don't like that. <laughs> that one looks really good. Then eat it. Like, no, but like, professional. <laughs> Your finger. <laughs> wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. Even better than mama. Is it too hot? Mmm. No. Mmm. <laughs> really? Yeah. Oh my god, you said that you weren't gonna like these ones. I thought they were gonna be like super hot. Absolutely delicious. Five stars. I hope you enjoyed watching me fail miserably at peeling boiled eggs. Make sure you like this video and subscribe to stay updated as I cook this book. Comment which recipe looked the most appealing to you or if you've tried any of these recipes.